across Bournemouth, Poole and Christchurch. This is 90.1 Hope FM. <laughs> Welcome to 90.1 Hope FM. We cover, cover Bournemouth Pool and Christchurch on FM and online around the world. I'm just going to show you around our on-air studio now. This is our studio. Nice and deadened for the sound. And a nice bit of aircon in the background here. This is the, the, the big chair. This is very comfortable. Um, I've got two screens here. All the music and, and adverts get played out from this side. And all the jingles and idents in the background that you hear get played out from this side. We've got four microphones, they're the coloured ones on the left here. Uh, we've got our first channel which plays out our, our music and advertisements and our other channel plays out all our jingles and background music. Um, we can also audition songs while we've got one going out on air so while you're listening to one song we may be listening to another song to decide what you're going to be listening to next. We really have got the power here. Uh, we've got a couple of decks for the CDs as well. We get some specialised music shows from 7 o'clock in the evening and presenters bring in their own specialised music, for example Bass House on a Friday night. And they play drum and bass, house and trance, so they play a lot of CDs and stuff, and also mini discs as well. We use Sky News, so, so we go over to Sky News, we link up with ISDN using this channel here. And also we can put live telephone calls for interviews and for phone-ins as well, and for competitions, etc. We can put people live on air with these two telephones here. So basically you don't need to worry about all of this stuff over here, this is just what makes it sound good and, and we look after that. But that's, that's our channels that we use and that's what you hear, this is where you hear it from. You're in the production studio now, um, here's where all the adverts and everything are made, all the jingles are made for the station. Um, Dan, who does the production work would normally sit here on a weekday um, anyone's coming in to pre-record a show to record a specialist show etc that can be done in here as well um, phone interviews and everything if you booked a celebrity for a phone interview and they're not available when you do the show you can pre-record that in here we also do our training courses in here as well so that people come in to learn they can actually get a more hands-on approach with something very similar to what we use in the main studio so how did you get your job I got a job on Hope FM through work experience. I um, I did my work experience March last year, and um, I started, you know, doing volunteer work. And I've just co-presented this show ever since Generation Y. Did you have any qualifications for it? Drama? Not really, but I did some work on an online website. Oh, did you? Yeah, for um. Didn't you study something specific for? Oh college? yes, um, I do media. Um, I think that's my main qualification. So how, how did you actually get in? Did you know any contacts or did you just email? I went on a database with jobs and I found Hope FM on there and I contacted them and I went, I would like your job. <laughs> and what did they say? They said, yeah, you're welcome to come in. They were really friendly, really welcoming and I've been here ever since. And how, what, what position are you now in this job? I'm co-presenter but today I'm filling in for Ryan Boyden who's my presenter and um, I'm nervous, but I'm getting through the show. So. <laughs> Are you enjoying it? <laughs> yes, it's very fun. Emma's been very helpful. So do you enjoy your job at um, Hope FM? Yeah, it doesn't feel like a job. You come in, you do like a two-hour show. Um, you come in and it's, it's just so enjoyable, so you don't actually feel like you're working. I love like that, yeah. I love it, yeah. Um, how, how many um, days do you, do you work a week? Um, I do the drive time show, which is five days a week, Monday to Friday, two hours between 5 and 7 p.m. <laughs> so you enjoy this? I love it, absolutely is love it, it. Is it complicated working all the buttons? I mean, It's not, no. Um, I actually started as a co-presenter, which is the best thing to do. You can sort of get more of a grip of radio and Hope FM actually run their own training courses. That's good. After doing that for a while um, with, with Kevin, who's now the station manager, um, I, being his co-presenter, I then went on the training course um, to gain more of sort of insight of background of radio, um, learn all about the radio ways and then the technical side and then applied that with the presenting skills that I already learned to come together and be a presenter. That's amazing. I, I wish I had that sort of thing. It's fantastic. It's, there's what? opportunities to, to be able to do that. Um, it's really good. We've had people come on work experience, actually go through the programme and now present their own shows. What did you do for high school? As in, how did you get from there to, you know, like high school? Because I'm in high school at the moment. Yeah. I don't know where to start, you know. What, what did you do in high school? Um, I left a few years ago, uh, and uh, more than a few years ago, and there wasn't as many opportunities about then as yeah, there are now in, in media. Yeah. There's a lot more. So I was, my, my advice would be to grab everything by the horns and go for every every opportunity you can apply for work experience placements apply for internships um, and do courses and, and just really get your name out there and, and keep going with it get voluntary work as well did you um study anything specific in high school 
Um, I didn't study any, anything specific in high school. Um, it's all come, come to me since so then. Did you not do any drama or anything like that? Um, I, I did art. I couldn't, wasn't asked to do drama as well. So um, oh, right. I, I would have liked to have done art, yeah. drama and music if I, if I could have my, my own ah. way. But obviously maths and English are essential. So do, do maths and English too. <laughs> Today the presenters are doing voluntary sure, work on Saturdays yeah, and another presenter yeah. has already oh. been on well, BBC Radio 1. Thanks for visiting the Hope FM studio today. I hope you've enjoyed it and found it beneficial to you. So do remember, stick with school, go to media school, do all of the stuff that I didn't get around to doing. Thank you for calling today. Do check us out at hopefm.com or 90.1 Hope FM. Give us a call on 777321 or email us on studio at hopefm.com. Have a nice day. Bye.